this is Stampy, and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video. And another video inside of Stampy's lovely world. And today in this video, I am going to be joined, as always, by Mr. El- Whoa! whoa! <laughs> Elfa Lee's got into costume. Do not do that to me. You terrify me then. <laughs> Imagine that. Imagine I just started the video and then hit the target, just barges into my bedroom and terrifies me. Do not do that again, Lee. <laughs> in this video, I am going to be joined by my good friend, Mr. Elfa Lee, uh, as well as Squid and Finball, who are running somewhere around my lovely world. I'm sure we're going to uh, run into them uh, a little bit later on. But before we do that, uh, it is time for me to have my breakfast and I'm not too hungry today uh, but I can have a I can have at least one slice here we go Num. There we go. That was absolutely lovely. There we go. We've had one slice each. We're on a diet. We're on our diet. We still got uh, a bit of the old Christmas fat on our edges, so we're going to try and uh, get rid of uh, some of that. <laughs> anyway, let's go over to the uh, the love garden and uh, give someone a shout out. Uh, if you don't know what my love garden is, uh, it's basically uh, a place of love. I got a big love heart here, and at the beginning of every single one of my videos in this world, uh, I go and look at a sign with someone's name on and I give them a shout out. And uh, today I am adding someone called that one girl, and uh, that's because she sent a video of a song she wrote uh, which was a cover of uh, Hey There Delilah uh, by Plain White Tees but instead of Hey There Delilah uh, it was Hey There Stampy and uh, it was really cool uh, she sang it really well she played the ukulele as well which was awesome and uh, yeah I thought it was really nice so I'm actually going to play a bit of it uh, for you now as I head over to my doghouse uh, so this is that one girl singing Hey There Stampy I So there's a, uh, a little short snippet of the song. Uh, if you do want to go and uh, hear the uh, full song, uh, I've left in the uh, the description a uh, link to the video if you want to go and see the uh, the full video and the song. But I want to say a big thank you to, uh, to, for sending it to me and uh, welcome to my love garden. And knock knock, squid, squid, can I come in? Hello, knock knock, can I can I come in? Are you going to even acknowledge me, squid? You've got a visitor at your door. Hello, <laughs> how are you doing today? <laughs> can I can I come in? <laughs> oh, what's going on here? Oh, he's decorating. What does this say down here? Um, I heart squid. Oh, is it an arrow it's saying squid this direction? What's going on down here? Wow, look, they're they're decorating. Oh, look, Finball's hard at work. I think I think Squid has hired the king to do a little bit of DIY. Look, he's putting up shelves. He's put a load of wardrobes. He's got a, a rather fancy looking uh, sofa down here and a television. And uh, through here, here is a squid slippery bedroom. Uh, what's going to be happening today? As I think Finball and uh, Squid are going to be working hard uh, decorating Squid, still kind of bare house, uh, while me and Lee go and uh, build something exciting and new. So uh, yeah, we're going to check back with you guys a little bit later on and uh, see what progress you have made. But first I'm going to go uh, up here and I think I'm going to take Mittens with me in this video because oh uh, yeah, I didn't take Mittens with me in my last video and I think she's uh, got to be missing me around about now. And Duncan, what are you doing up here, Duncan? Have you seen Mittens? I thought Mittens would be up here. Oh, maybe she's uh, still in her bedroom. Rise and shine, Mittens. You got to... Where is she? Where, where, where is Mittens? Have you seen Mittens, Lee? Is she, is she not down here? Hello? Excuse me, Lee. Mittens? Where, where, where is she, Duncan? Is she out here? Oh, here she is. Hello, Mittens. What are you doing? Were you looking at the sun rising? <laughs> I guess Mittens and Duncan can join me, seeing as they can't bear to be apart. Uh, I guess they can uh, both join us in this video. And I realise I've not yet mentioned what it is we're going to be building. Today we are building a bar. It's going to be kind of like an old traditional English pub. Uh, but instead of being a, uh, a normal bar, it's going to be a milk bar. It's going to be a bar where the only beverage they sell uh, is milk. Uh, so yeah, certainly myself and Mittens are, are going to enjoy visiting it. And we're going to call it the Crazy Cow. And uh, you'll see why uh, a little bit later on. But uh, for this video, we're going to be building the outside of it. And then in the next video, we'll probably go and uh, start building uh, all of the, the inside of it. Uh, but the first thing I want to do before we get started is uh, uh, put down a crafting table and a furnace. Uh, just because I've got a whole load of uh, cobblestone on me. And uh, I'm going to need to uh, smelt that to try and make it into smooth stone. And then we use the smooth stone to uh, make some, some stone bricks. Because pretty much uh, the entire thing is uh, going to be made out of stone bricks on the bottom. Uh, so it's going to be stone bricks here. And then on the top, it's going to be uh, spruce and uh, white wall. And it looks like uh, Lee is there already getting to work uh, building away uh, along this side so I guess I'm gonna uh, build this way and uh, the main part of it is gonna be 
Uh, it's going to be 16 blocks by 11. So I think if I go to here and then go down. Oh, sorry, Mittens, I didn't mean to, to shove a block in your face. Yeah, I think if we go to about here. Uh, so it's going to be pretty big. It's not massive, uh, but as uh, compared to uh, a lot of the uh, the other buildings around here, it's probably going to be the, the biggest thing here. And there's going to be a whole load of seats and a jukebox and a bar. And uh, the idea of the bar is it's always going to sell fresh milk. Uh, so that basically means that uh, we're going to have a cow uh, above the bar uh, who's going to be, he's going to be happy there. We're going to make a, a nice little cow home up there for him uh, but the idea is you can go up to the bar and you ask for milk and then you just literally lift up and you go and grab the udder of the cow and you can pour a very fresh glass of milk and um that might sound disgusting but i don't know we'll see we'll see whether the uh, the customers like it and uh, we want it to look like a, an old traditional pub so i'm going to use uh spruce wood uh, to do some some beams along the entire place so i think if we do the the corners and then uh, build up like this and then uh, if we go if we go three blocks high i think with the stone and then do a, a row of spruce and then uh, above that we can do all of the uh, all of the white walls so if you go and uh, fill in all of the um all of the the stone bricks lee uh, i'll go around and do the uh, the top which is where the the white wall is going to be and then i think the the roof is just going to be stone bricks as well uh, but we're going to do it all like slanted and all fancy with um stairs just to make it look like yeah like an old traditional pub like the idea as it's going to look really old and uh, traditional and normal. Uh, but the only thing that's going to be slightly weird is there's going to be a massive face of a cow or just a cow's eyes with the eyes looking in random direction. Uh, hence why it's going to be called the, the crazy cow uh, milk bar. So uh, the first thing I want to do is uh, the front, which is where we're going to have a uh, doorway. So I think we should have uh, some windows along here. So if I go uh, four blocks along here and uh, then go and do the front here. And while I'm doing the front, if you want to go do the back, Lee, and then, yeah, we can meet in the middle and we can and see uh, yeah what well, the the thing is going to look like completed so the doorway is going to be here uh, i think we're going to have a double doorway so if i go one two three four and then put some uh more spruce wood here and then this is going to be where the the other window is going to be letting some some light in and then there's going to be a little bit sticking out here uh, which is going to be the the little entrance way so if i go uh, if, I think if i go out to three blocks uh, then that way it's just one block away from the path and go like this then I can have the the doors uh, in front of here and I think once again I'm gonna do spruce wood which is gonna go out uh, from there and then if I fill the the rest in with with stone bricks uh, this will be our nice little entrance way fill that in there and then the roof I will just use stone bricks as well and I'm already running out you can see why the first thing I did was uh, put down a furnace to go and get some uh, some more smelting so uh, yeah this is gonna be where the the doorway is gonna be shall I, shall I make it now then uh, shall I go and make the doors now, I'm gonna have to of course break away this here because this is going to be uh, the inside of the pub which will look um it will look a lot nicer than this i promise you once it's uh, all finished so i can break away all of this here and then if i go and hop over to my crafting table uh, i can make myself some planks and then some uh, some doors and i can go and plonk uh, both of the the doors in here one there and then one on this side Do you like it oh look duncan's in already we've already got our first customer <laughs> and we've not even built anything in there oh god this doesn't look very good here at the front does it i think we should do spruce the the whole way along the front here uh, rather than the 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 stone i think that will look quite cool like i basically want the the old traditional beams um i did think at first about maybe doing it uh, with black wool uh, but i think it might look a bit too much like the uh, the sushi restaurant i built in my fun land and i thought uh, just using a uh, dark wood might uh, make it look uh, a little bit more authentic so uh, on the same here i'm going to go and do uh, a few beams i think i'm going to have uh, another window along the side here maybe three blocks wide uh, just like a, a little slit window along here so if i go and uh, fill in some more uh, panels along here and then go do the the same on the other side and then we basically need to just recreate what we've just built here uh, but higher uh, but instead of using the uh, the stone, we're going to use white wool uh, because it's going to be like half... Um yeah, half made out of stone, then half white wool, uh, which does kind of look like what the uh, the old sort of English pubs used to look like. Uh, so if I do the same there, go along three blocks, and uh, then do the the same here, and then if I fill in the corner, then that should be the the whole bottom done. And then what I'm gonna do is I might uh, go and visit Squid and Finball quick and just see uh, how progress is going along for those guys. So I need to go and fill this in here, and I, th I think that's the same. I think that's the the same as I did it on the other side. So I'm gonna try and uh, hop upstairs. I think I might just make uh, a few ladders, then I can 
can hop up to the top and yeah and start building up there. Oh, I can hear some googlies. I can hear some some googlies coming out from somewhere. Oh god, he's right here. He is right here. Right, get him, get him, Duncan. Go get him. Go, go teach him a lesson. Go teach him a lesson. Good boy, Duncan. Good boy. Well played. <laughs> Mittens are just sort of sitting there watch on. I think Duncan only did that to try and impress Mittens. He saw that Mittens was watching and wanted to try and seem all heroic, so he went for the googly. <laughs> anyway, let's go and uh, carry on building up here. So I think I'm going to literally do it the same. I think if I go up here and then uh, fill all of this in with white uh, wall along here and then I think it was there and then there was three I think it was one two three and then spruce again and then one two and then spruce here. Right, let's see what Lee's done along the back. So he's gone uh, two blocks spruce, two blocks spruce, two blocks spruce. You can see how many excuses I'm trying to uh, <laughs> make to, uh, just to say the word spruce. <laughs> I don't know why. Why is it so fun to say that word spruce? Because at first I thought it was just me being weird, uh, but then I asked you and I found out a lot of you just love saying that word as well. <laughs> anyway, so let's go and uh, fill this along here. Hopefully I'm uh, keeping up the pattern. There we go. I think this uh, fits in uh, pretty quickly. I feel like I'm doing a quick build or something here. I never build this fast. Look what we've built already. Not even halfway through the video. I'm probably just about halfway through the video and we've pretty much already built like this this massive building We've got to give ourselves a massive pat on the back after this and be careful Duncan Be very careful. I'll not be giving myself a pat on the back if you go and jump off there And there's Finball trying to help by just putting down a few random pieces of blue wool. Thanks for the help help Finball <laughs> It's the it's the effort that counts isn't it? <laughs> I think maybe he's upset because I did say we're gonna go and check on uh, how squid's doing so uh, once I've just done these last few blocks here uh, I am going to go and uh, check on him and see uh, how things going on there. And are you okay, Duncan? Right, Duncan, drop down there, okay? Because otherwise, um, yeah, otherwise I'm not going to be able to place that. And you can have some pork chops to get your health up again. And uh, yeah, let's go and uh, quickly go and visit Squid and let's see how uh, progress is going on the uh, the Squid camp. I do feel like I'm doing a quick build. I feel like it's it's me and Lee against Squid and Finball. Oh, be careful, Finball! There's a creeper. There is a creeper under Mittens Condo. Oh, where's he gone? Oh, he's gone. He's, hi oh, he's hiding down the water. Can you see him? Can you see his little head poking out there? There he is. You can't fool me. Look at that. One shot and he is taken out. And oh, look, there's a there's a trail of cakes. I think they were trying to lure me down this way, I think. Oh, look, a nice blue carpet on the way in. Uh, home sweet home. I'm not sure what the, the buttons are. Oh, and look at this. This is a, a rather fancy carpet. We've got his little fishing area down here. Mittens is already trying it out, trying to catch some fish. And uh, down here, we've got the, uh, the living room and the bedroom. It's not looking too shabby, Squid. It's certainly uh, a lot brighter and uh, more colourful than it was uh, when you started. Anyway, let's go and uh, see if we can go and uh, get the uh, the crazy cow uh, milk bar finished. Uh, at least the outside of it. And uh, we should have probably slept, to be honest. But uh, to be honest, I feel, I feel okay. I feel like we're dealing with the googlies quite well. I feel, I feel up for a, a fight right now. I feel like I can handle it, especially with Duncan protecting me. And look at these cakes. Look at these cakes all over the place. <laughs> you can tell this is Stampy's lovely world when there's cakes littered uh, along the uh, the entire path. And oh, look, I think I think Lee's going and already starting to build the interior. Okay, so while you're doing that, Lee, uh, I'll go and uh, do the uh, the last few final bits up here. Uh, I'm just going to make a, a little temporary staircase up here. And uh, I think if I do a... um. Another ring of uh, spruce uh, all around the uh, the top here, and uh, then I can start doing the roof. Uh, what I might actually do is I might leave the roof for now, uh, just because it's gonna it's pretty massive and it's uh, a little bit complicated as well. Uh, I might leave that for now, and uh, then do that between videos, and then I can go and uh, uh, help Lee doing the inside. So as I said, the idea is it's gonna look very old-fashioned and traditional, but then it's just gonna have a massive crazy cow face over the bar, and it's only gonna sell milk. There's gonna be no there's gonna be no pub snacks. There's gonna be no other drinks. If you you want milk this is the place to go if you want anything other than milk uh yeah then maybe uh look elsewhere <laughs> what i might do is just the uh, the roof of the little top bit up here i think i might have a, like a a little archway on the on the entrance on your way in so uh, if i go and oh are you are you all right mittens mittens and duncan are there chasing each other around duncan has gone and sat in the seat up there do you want to sit down up there duncan and behave i'm sure mittens is going to come and join you in a minute she always seems to do so and i'm going to go and uh, make some uh, some stone brick stairs if i can and then that way i can make a, a little archway uh, along the uh, along the, uh, the top up here. Looks like, there we go, look, Mittens has gone to join Duncan and so has Finball as well. <laughs> anyway, let's go and uh, hop up here and uh, let's go and build uh, the nice little archway for the beginning. So if I just do steps on this side and then steps on this side as well and then uh, I should have some more blocks. Oh no, I haven't got any uh, more blocks left. Uh, let's see how things are going with the furnace to see how much smooth stone I got. There we go. That's almost completely finished. I'm going to go and uh, put some more in just in case I need some uh, more a little bit later on. Uh, so yeah, I, I've now, I can now make some more 
stone bricks. And I can finish the uh, the top off up here. If I just hop up here. Sorry, Lee. Sorry for getting in your way. And then go. Oh, God. More googlies. There's a zombie behind you. You might want to deal with that, Lee. <laughs> go on, Duncan. Go get him. Go get him, boy. <laughs> oh, I think he's got a bit bored of chasing after the googlies. Yeah, and if I go and do the, the stairs like this. And then the stairs on the, the other side like this as well. Uh, let's hop down and uh, see what it looks like. I kind of like the look of it. I kind of like the, the look of it already. I think it, it manages to, to fit in quite nicely. Uh, I always try and make sure that all of the, the buildings around here look different from each other. And uh, I think this certainly looks different uh, to all of the uh, the other buildings in the area. So let me go and uh, fill this in here. And I think Lee's desperately trying to get my attention. I think he's uh, asking about the floor. Um, I had planned to do, uh, I think I was going to do spruce planks and oak. Uh, but I think this looks fine. I, th I think this looks good. Uh, let let's carry on the pattern then. So he's got uh, oak, birch, oak, birch, oak, birch. So I think... I might actually have some uh, some birch wood on me, I believe. If I go and make... There we go. If I make a, a bunch more planks here. And there we go. Fimble's helping out as well. Uh, we can go and uh, fill all of this in. And then, yeah, I think I might go and uh, start building the... Uh, the actual bar and uh, maybe even start uh, putting in a, a few of the uh, the tables and chairs for everyone. And so I think I'm going to have the bar starting uh, about here. And uh, it's going to be quite big because that's where the uh, the big cow's face is going to be. So uh, I think if I go out to about here and then go... Oh, good, I didn't mean to do that. Go along here and then if I go from the, the same place on this side... Excuse me, Lee. Just a tiny bit to the right. There we go. <laughs> I can go and uh, place uh, this in here on this side as well. And uh, then I'm going to have um, uh, just like a, a big room above here. Uh, if we build up some pillars along like this. And uh, this is where the, the cows are going to be. There's going to be a room up here, which is going to be... I'm going to call it my cow hotel. Uh, because that sounds a bit better than cow prison or whatever. <laughs> whatever way you could uh, look at it. And so we're going to have uh, with uh, brown and uh, white wool. Uh, we're going to make a, a big cow's face and a cow's eyes at the top there. And as I said, the eyes are going to be looking in all sorts of uh, crazy different directions. As this is the uh, the crazy cow after all. Uh, so if I get rid of this bit here, I'm going to make a, a little trap door to put down there. I might as well make a, another crafting table inside here, seeing as we're probably going to need it quite a lot. And then, yeah, this is uh, how the bar's going to be. To be honest, I am absolutely amazed at how much progress we've managed to make in this video. We've built all of this. We've built all of this from scratch. When I walked to this area at the beginning of the video, there was nothing here. And we've almost entirely built like the outside of this building. All I need to do is just finish off the roof, which really won't take that much like, longer. And then we've done it. I am absolutely amazed. And we're already starting uh, to build some of the uh, the inside. So uh, inside here, I think we're going to have... Um Along the back here, we have like a, a back bar where we can have maybe some brewing stands, uh, which will look like, um, I don't know, like like optics for filling up drinks and stuff. I put a, a chest down here, uh, which can be full of uh, empty buckets, uh, which we can fill up with, um, uh, yeah, have a bunch, bunch of empty buckets so we can get all the, uh, the milk from the cow. And the only real big difficult thing is uh, going to be trying to get a cow up here. So we're going to have to try and deal with that uh, in, the, in, in the next video, I guess, then. Anyway, let me go and uh, make a, a few seats around the place. I think these seats I'm going to make uh, out of birch wood uh, just to make it fit in. Seeing as it is a milk bar, I want everything to be uh, sort of quite pale and white in here. So if I go and do maybe a couple seats along here and then a couple seats along there, maybe. And I think for the table... I'm going to use. I think I'll go for some stone table. So uh, I'll go and put that down like that and then go and do the, the same on this side over here. Put two steps down there and then the table will be there. So another two steps there and uh, some stone bricks in the middle just like that. And then uh, I think I'll do some some tables and chairs down here as well. Um, it kind of it kind of does blend into the uh, the bar a little bit. Maybe we could uh, change the color of it there. And uh, I think for those ones, seeing as there's not much room, uh, I might actually use uh, some fences. Uh, if you make a, a fence and then put a pressure plate on the top of it. And oh, careful, careful, don't hit me. My dog's going to go crazy. Duncan's sitting down outside. Oh, everyone's eating some cake. This is not the place to eat cake. If you want to eat cake, Stampy's Hot Buns is just next door. <laughs> oh, who wants a game of cake peekaboo then? Come on, who wants a game of pe cake peekaboo? Finball, do you want a game? <laughs> okay, okay, there we go. I'll give you a game of cake peekaboo. 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 <laughs> All right, Squid, do you want to go? I'm going to switch sides. Ready, Squid? Peekaboo. Peekaboo, you've got to turn to the side slightly. I can't even see your eyes. There we go. Peekaboo. Peek it, doesn't, it doesn't work. <laughs> it doesn't work with you. I'm, I'm sorry, Squid. Your, your eyes are just too high. And that was that's what makes you so handsome. <laughs> peekaboo, Lee. Peekaboo. Sorry, I didn't mean to leave you out. Do you want, do you want a game of cake? Peekaboo mittens? No, I don't I don't think uh, mittens is uh, interested. Anyway, let's go and uh, finish off my table then. If I put down... Um, oh, God. Excuse me, Lee. <laughs> put a block right there. Oh, and then he got rid of the block in the background. <laughs> We're the worst team for building. If I put down uh, a fence down there... And uh, if I go and make a, uh, a pressure plate, uh, a smooth, uh, smooth stone pressure plate, and then if I plonk that on top, 
Uh, there we go. We got a nice little tiny table and chairs. I am absolutely amazed with our progress. So, as I said in the next video, we're going to try and get a cow up there and uh, finish off the uh, the rest of the inside and uh, maybe get the roof done. Uh, but before that, I'm going to very quickly uh, hop over here. I might leave Duncan sitting down for now, uh, just because I think he's I think he's upset with someone. Someone's upset him, so he's there growling. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to go and uh, have a check uh, on uh, what Squid's done uh, over in his little house down here uh, next to my dog cow. So... Uh, last time I saw it, I was pretty impressed with what he's done. So let's see uh, how much he's added since then. Oh, he's put uh, an ink sack up on the wall. I should have guessed. <laughs> another ink sack on the wall up there. And another ink sack on the wall over here. I'm noticing the theme. <laughs> he's got his uh, kitchen up here. Oh, he can eat some sand and some iron bars. Is that how you get your teeth so sharp and pointy, Squid? Do you, do you chew on some iron bars? It, is it like braces for you? <laughs> oh, look, there's a, another ink sack here and... Another ink sack here. Oh, that, that one's a bit wonky. That one looks more like an aubergine. <laughs> and there's another ink sack over here and one up there. And yeah, I certainly do uh, notice the theme. What's he got in his wardrobe then? Do you mind if I just go for all your stuff, by the way, Squid? <laughs> to be fair, I don't think there's uh, too much in there. I guess he's got to fill up all of these wardrobes. I do like this design, though, by the way. I, I do like the uh, the sort of the chest inside of a wardrobe. It does look really cool. And uh, this is where his bedroom is. Oh, he's got a double bed. Maybe he's expecting some visitors. Oh, Mitten seems to like it. Mittens is just testing out the mattress for you, Squid. She seems to like it. <laughs> and, of course, a, uh, another ink sack on the wall uh, directly opposite. It's nice. It's nice to see your room finally finished. It did take you a while. Uh, but, yeah, I'm I'm absolutely loving the look of it. Uh, sadly though, uh, we have just about run out of time in this video. Uh, I'll be all oh, does this say up here. Can you find nine ink sacks? Uh, I reckon so. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That was about the easiest game ever. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> anyway, that's about the end of this video here. There'll be a link in the description to the uh, next part of my Let's Play once I've uploaded it, uh, where we're going to be finishing off the Crazy Cow Milk Bar. I want to say a big thank you to Alpha Leaf in Born Ballistic Squid uh, for joining me, uh, helping me, and uh, keeping me entertained throughout the video. Uh, hopefully you all enjoyed it, and will join me in our next episode. But uh, for now, I'll see you all later. Bye!